Hey family, I am getting ready to go do some shopping in that good old Dollar Tree, <laughs> grabbing some stuff for the house, but it's my off day. We voted against Cedar Point today because hubby was pretty tired, but I still got stuff to do. I'm having like, I don't know, I'm tired. I'm overwhelmingly tired and I've been struggling with like my OMAD. I've been struggling with getting my steps in. I've just been struggling and I realized like, girl, it's that time and <laughs> and I kept wondering like why am I so frustrated and overwhelmingly hungry like nothing was going right so I realized that that's what it was I'm really trying to give myself some grace today I've got things to do so you can, you can never really stop but I figured I would take you guys along with me so let's go shop the Dollar Tree we may have to stop at Walmart but we're just really grabbing small stuff like some cleaning supplies for the house and um they had chicken breast on sale you guys it was like a dollar and some change a pound i kid you not i have so much chicken breast in my freezer that it will probably last me the next two months so i don't really have to get a lot of groceries i just have to get like maybe something to make some sides with and some veggies and stuff like that so i may do that today i may just kind of eat what we have at home today and then figure it out over the weekend but i'm taking it easy because i've been beating myself up long enough and I'm ready to just relax. So let's go Dollar Tree shop. Get myself, I'm just going to go ahead and grab a cart. All right, let's go shop. Okay, so we got Dollar Tree Plus. I am thoroughly unimpressed. We do not need to be paying $5 and $3 for this garbage. Are you serious? Are you freaking serious? Like, are you serious? Are you serious? Okay, Dollar Tree is tripping. Or is it just me? If it's me, let me know in the comments, but ain't no way five dollars for some of this stuff is out of control look at this <laughs> look at this it's no way five dollars like are you kidding i can get a nicer one at target five dollars they have these tumblers like at walmart um, see you know what i'm they about to make me get out this dollar store and go to walmart Okay, they do have like this weird little tech section. And I guess this is supposed to be in competition with like Five Below. But I think I'm gonna just go to Five Below because I'm not, I'm, I'm not feeling it. Seriously, y'all, if I'm tripping, tell me I'm tripping, but ain't no way they selling this stuff in this dollar store for $5. It's trash. This is the stuff I'm really here for. Like I need dish liquid and Comet and I don't like awesome spray. I like method spray, but I guess that's supposed to be similar to method spray. Um, but I do, I take that back. I do like awesome. I like this stuff right here. That awesome is like good stuff. I'm gonna get one of these but i think i'm gonna just go to walmart because i don't see the need to pay a dollar 25 for some of this stuff when i can get a bigger one at walmart for the same price if not cheaper but there was this laundry oh there it is i saw this stuff right here on i want to say tiktok and i want to give it a try so i am going to get that these little dog treat bowls are cute, but we got so many dogs that we got a huge container for like our dog stuff. These are a little bit too small. I always buy like this little stuff out of here too, like the scouring pads and the sponges and stuff like that. But I promise I'm starting to wonder if I'm even overpaying on this stuff out of here because it's just, it's just not it. I did see this though. It's um, a steel sponge. I might grab that for the stove. 
I've been doing just fine without that um, scrubbing brush. So I just got these little baskets so that I can put like the different cleaning stuff for the kitchen in one and then cleaning stuff for the bathroom in the other one. That little container um, is for the kids, the boys. And then I got me some gloves and um, the stuff for the washing machine and then this awesome cleaner. And yeah, I think it's a wrap. For the Dollar Tree. Well, that was fun. <laughs> now it's time to go to Wally World because I still need to get carpet fresh and I didn't get the dish liquid. And what else do I need? I'm, oh, you know what? I gotta get Tide Pods and I almost wanna go to BJ's, which is like a Sam's Club. I don't know if it's regional or if it's national, but yeah, I wanna go there because it's usually cheaper and they have coupons. But I don't know if I feel like doing all that today. <sighs> I don't know. I know you guys probably heard like the wind noises <laughs> in the back when I was walking and I actually have something new. So I have this new microphone and my best friend Tia actually got it, but me and her have different devices. So it works for my phone and not for hers. So I ended up getting it from her and it works. Like it works very well, but sometimes it makes the wind sound worse <laughs> and sometimes it completely cancels it out and i have to kind of test to see what i'm doing wrong and um i'm not using it all the time yet but i hope to be soon but another downside is i have to take my phone case off of my phone to use this as of right now i'm taking the phone case off plugging this up every time and then hoping that i'm not making the noise worse than it was without the mic if you guys do youtube and you have a good mic drop the link to the mic or let me know what kind of mic you guys are using and if this is a good one and i'm possibly just using it wrong uh let me know some tips or even a video i can find to to help me out with this because i really like it and when it works good it works great but apparently there's some user error and i'm doing something that's causing some problems but yeah let's head to walmart so we can get the rest of this stuff never mind y'all we going to bj's because i just looked up um the tie pods the ones that i buy wherever i go and they are on sale at BJ's. Plus, I get a $3 coupon off. So, when I come to Walmart, I think I paid $22 or $23. But it's a much smaller container. And this one is on sale. And you get a lot more. So, I'm going to head to BJ's. And you guys are coming with me. <laughs> Alright, babes. Let's go to BJ's. Y'all know I can't make it nowhere far without having a pee. So, I got to go to the bathroom before. I have to go back and get a cart because I'm only getting two things, but I don't feel like carrying them around the store. I've tried their store brand, the uh, Berkeley Jensen, and I don't hate it. Like, it's not bad, but I prefer either these Tide Hygienic Clean or the Tide Ultra Oxy. And I think these are the ones that have the coupon right now. So I'm going to get these. I was wrong and they both got a coupon and I can never remember which ones I like better, the Oxy Clean or the Hygienic Clean. Now I wanna get the other ones. <laughs> um, I'ma just go with my first line and keep the Oxy and then I will get the Hygienic next time maybe i don't know we'll see <laughs> okay i gotta get some dish look with the dawn is 10.99 i gotta see if they got a coupon but i like dawn but the kids are the dishwashers and they like palm olive and i know for a fact that has a coupon so i think i'm going to get the palm olive and i actually like pine allen better than pine saw it's 12.79 i'm gonna see if they have a coupon if it's cheaper then like if it's a two dollar coupon i'm gonna just get the pine saw but if not i'm gonna run back to walmart and get the pine oven there is an eight dollar off coupon on my coffee too i'm definitely gonna grab this it seems expensive but when you put it in perspective 30 bucks for 72 days worth of coffee then um it's worth it because you yeah, have 41 bucks and then well 42 bucks and then eight dollars off so 
$34, not too bad. Something is telling me to get these, so I came back. I'm gonna just get the hygienic clean ones instead. Oh. All right, we can get out of here. Hello. Thank you. You are welcome. Thank you, you too. Y'all, this is why I need to get back to my old, hyper organized, like super anal about everything self because number one thing on the list for me to get today was dog food. I just remembered right now that I left out the house to get dog food. <laughs> Along with some other stuff too, but top of the list was dog food. You know what, lists, just make a damn list, Unique. Just, just make a list. I promise the thing is though it's like okay when i got my free time then i'm always doing something and i need to really slow down and like if i got a schedule like an hour out of my day just for me to like mentally get my mind together and get organized in my head i need to start doing that because it's the weight loss it's the kids it's work it's hubby is finding time to do things for myself but really doing things for myself is taking care of everybody else <laughs> so um yeah i gotta i gotta carve out that time to get back organized i was on it with meal planning for the family i was on it with grocery shopping like and now i've kind of just gotten into this well when we run out we'll go get it or when it's low let me know and i'll go grab it and i didn't used to be that way because we would never be low on anything because i was like hey no i was really on it and i missed those things about myself so i really want to get back to that but moral of the story is we got to go get dog food i just saw them reverse that big old thing up in there that's some skill wow look at that baby right there this particular walmart i'm at i don't think i've ever been to i just looked up the closest one to the bj's i went to and it actually took me out farther than i normally go but walmart is walmart so i can find what i need i had my rain coffee today and if you are interested i did a video about i didn't do a video about this coffee but i mentioned this coffee and then the link to the maker of this coffee is in the description it is very good the coffee is made like little tea bags i think i have one in my purse i'll show you guys of course i got one <laughs> it's all crinkled up but i keep these in my purse and it you just put it in there put some hot water in it let it seep a little bit and then dress your coffee with your cream sugar whatever you put in there and you're probably wondering like okay you just bought k-cups but you have these like what's your deal why are you obsessed with coffee like that and i kind of am like I have to have K-Cups because like in the morning, if the kids make the coffee for me, my son Braylon will just pop me a K-Cup in. He knows exactly how much cream and it's perfect every time. And I've always done that until I discovered this brand, which this is great, but to be honest, sometimes it's easier to just make a K-Cup. And then like if I'm in the office and I don't really like the coffee, I will um, stick this in my cup and just use hot water from like the, um, you know, you know just variety <laughs> all right let's make this quick because walmart is so draining i don't know if it's just me but going in walmart is such a chore but can't beat the prices sometimes <laughs> I told y'all I had so much chicken because it was on sale, so I need to get rice. I like jasmine rice. All right, I got the rice for the family, and then I need to get my quinoa. I'm showing y'all this just to compare. That's like almost 30 bucks right there, and it's 48 in there, well, 25 bucks, and I paid $32 for 72, and it's Starbucks, so. I got a way better deal. And I don't even see the Starbucks coffee in here. Okay, here they are. So you see $33 for 44 of the French roast and I just paid $32 for 72. All right, we have been back and forth with a lot of different dog food brands. This is what we started out with. We started off with Ions. We went to this one, 
They're pure balance, pro puppy. They like that, the older dogs will eat it too. And then we just switched to, here we go, to the blue buffalo. And I guess they like that enough too, but that's adult. We need the puppy, I don't think they have it. We may have to get something else today. I can't keep a phone charged to save my life, but I did get what I needed out of Walmart. We got the dog food and um they did not have the pine saw the pine island that i wanted and they had a pine saw that was like not that big for eight dollars and i had just left bj's and a way bigger one was twelve dollars so <laughs> and it's funny because my cousin and my mom makes fun of me when i shop because i can never just do all i gotta do in one place i gotta be in 10 different places but i am about to run to either a home depot or a lowe's because my son my oldest son actually needs his own house key and i'm gonna go ahead and have his key made and then i should be able to grab the pine alley and i'm done for the day y'all i am done um i ran out of coffee a long time ago so <laughs> so i am like my stomach is like okay it is four o'clock you starting to get a little hungry plus it's hard not to eat when i'm like home when i'm off work because it's way more convenient for me to grab food when i'm at work it's kind of easy to be like okay i'm not gonna eat because like i didn't bring anything to eat and then i'm not going to buy anything to eat but when you at home and it's food all around you or when i'm like riding around and it's restaurants everywhere it's kind of hard to not eat um and it don't make sense for me to do another coffee even though i could but i may need a little snacky snack um, or I just wait till I get home and suffer a little bit, but I do need some water. And yeah, this is probably the most mundane <laughs> shopping vlog because it's no rhyme or reason. It kind of is. I'm getting house stuff, but at the same time, back to what I was saying earlier, I just need to get more organized and structured with YouTube, with weight loss, with shopping with saving with all of that and i think that's the story of all of our lives kind of finding that balance to where everything is working and everything is in line but it's hard y'all it's hard and the good thing about it is we get another chance every day so we don't necessarily have to be tied into whatever situations we put ourselves in we can get ourselves out and we can do better and that's what it's all about so one last stop and then i am done with shopping for today i'm so glad you guys came with me it was kind of relaxing it's, it's relaxing to be in front of the camera and it's relaxing to just be by myself sometimes and do what i gotta do and like i said try to clear my head and get that that just organization and clarity that i need for real for real for real final stop of the day um i'm at lowe's you see all the nice flowers and stuff out there i'm gonna go ahead and get christian my oldest and my second oldest um their house keys made because i think they're old enough now and i got caught in a situation last week where christian was running out and um i had to leave out before he had to leave out so it's definitely time for him to have a key so let's go get what we gotta get and honestly if they don't have it that's it are so well some of them are so luscious some of them are a little sad this is my favorite little section in any home depot or lowe's probably because i don't really have much of a backyard and i envy anybody who has room for oh my god this is so stinking cute like so cute All right, let me get what I gotta get and get out of here. I've been at this for two hours and two hours is long enough out of the day. I'm supposed to be off work and <laughs> I accomplished nothing. The good news is I can see the pine island from here so I know they got it. So I don't have to go anywhere else and then we gotta go get these keys made. I feel like that's a good deal for those microfiber cloths and I really do like them. But I know I can get like a whole bunch of them from Amazon for cheaper than that. Oh, here we go. Oh, $12? Nah, I ain't paying that. Uh, $17? Nope. I will say stuff like these brushes and stuff is definitely worth it to probably get at the Dollar Tree because, I don't know, they're a little expensive in here. This is what I was searching for. It is, let's see, Pine Saw, Pine Saw, Pine Allen, 
I don't want the lavender. I want the regular. Pine Allen. I don't know. Somewhere around $10. I've never tried this Zep before. Pronounced Zep or Z-E-P. But I'm going to give that a try too. So I got the sponge daddies, the Zep and the Pine Allen. And then I got to go get the keys. They have this whole key cutting station right here. But there's also down there where you can make a key yourself, which looks pretty convenient, but I don't trust myself. So I'm away for an associate. I'll just get my keys cut the good old fashioned way by associate. Did y'all hear them over the intercom? I need help. I didn't press that button and it said that like six times. Nobody has come over here. So are they encouraging me to go down and do it myself? Cause I'm not. Wait for somebody to cut this damn key. I am done. This trunk is a mess. I got everything I need. I'm taking my butt home. Even though I wasn't super organized in my shopping today, I did get a lot of things that I've been meaning to get. I'm happy that I was able to get out to myself because I haven't done that a lot lately and just me getting out by myself like in the past i would take my off day and really just go out walk shop do what i need to do and enjoy my own company <laughs> but i haven't done that a lot lately and um it feels good but i will say that when i've done it in the past for the most part i would be like okay i'm gonna stop and get me like a smoke gouda or something from starbucks or get me a refresher and um like just something and i decided against that because not only do i not need the extra calories i literally just spent money for coffee for at home like we've got so much chicken that we bought on sale that i don't need to be out buying stuff and i'm trying to just teach myself better habits smarter habits and like appreciate the stuff that i already have more instead of being out like oh i see it i want it i need to stop doing that and i'm not a big fat fast food person don't get me wrong but me just having the space to myself and instead of me spending starbucks money for five or seven or however many of us it is i'm only spending starbucks money for one so i like to take advantage of that sometimes but yeah i decided against it today so i'm making baby steps and um you know just trying to retrain and recondition myself for this weight loss journey for this financial health journey for this life journey and just mastering it and and being grateful with everything that i do have oh i did spend oh uh, i spent under 100 bucks today i will say that i spent no maybe around 100 bucks but i got stuff that's going to sustain us for a long time and i'm going to get back to making my list so that my shopping trips are um convenient i'm not wasting gas i'm not wasting time and like i already know what i'm going to get where i'm going to get it from who has the best sales it is warm y'all it is warm i put this on because it was kind of chilly i am sweating you see the sweat i'm gonna go ahead and wrap this video up guys i really appreciate you all spending the day with me if you like the video if you like <laughs> kind of hanging out doing mundane stuff definitely subscribe oh i gotta get some gas see there's always something i gotta get some gas Love you all. I will see you in the next one.